Hey, how's it going, YouTube? Today I decided to make uh, iMovie tutorials. Everything from importing your footage to adding titles and creating video effects, as well as trimming and all that good stuff. So, without further ado, let's start out with something basic. And yeah, so today I'm going to teach you how to import footage from a camera like mine, such as mine. This is a Canon Vixia HF200. It takes a USB plug and it has to be charged into a power plug at the same time. Yours might be like that, or who knows, maybe you have a flip, which many of you do have. All you gotta do is take it and plug it into the back. So yeah, I'm gonna go to ScreenFlow and show y'all how to do this, okay. As I said earlier, this will be a tutorial on how to import your footage from a camera to iMovie. So right now, on my camera, it's being recognized by the Mac. And when it is recognized, as you can see, this little thing pops up, as well as iPhoto. Just close out of iPhoto, because you want movies. So, this little thing is a disc that appears or represents your camera. Okay, that's another thing, how you know uh, the Mac recognizes your cameras, that little disc pops up. So let's get into iMovie. Open it up. And sometimes a little window appears right away, and other times you have to do it manually. This little window I'm talking about is this. This little window right here. In case you missed that, I was going a little too fast, I'll do it again. Basically what you want to say is file and import from camera. Alright, so by default all these clips are checked. So since I'm doing a tutorial, I only want to show you, uh, or I want to show you the import, but I only want to do a couple of short little clips, so it'll be fast when I import them. You know what I'm saying? So let's go find those. They're right here. So I'm going to say uncheck all. I'm going to click these, check them. Now I don't know if you saw that. But this little window right now is loading all these uh, thumbnails. But if you want to be quick about it, just click the thumbnail that you think it is, where it is, where it's at, and it'll appear instantly. Okay? So basically, as it's loading, and say you have a ton of clips and you want to skip to the point, you just do what I'm doing right now, just click the clips. That's besides the point. So I got all these clips selected and checked and I'm just going to say import checked. But I'm going to show you a couple more things. So first of all, these little pictures are thumbnails. If you look to the right of my video right now, not actually here, but when you watch this on YouTube, if you look to the right of any YouTube video, you'll see it says, you know, related videos. Um, all those videos are represented by thumbnails, which these are thumbnails as well. Basically, all a thumbnail is is a little picture that represents a video. So, in this little picture right here, these little things I have checked already, clips I'm going to import, represents a video. I'm going to play that real quick. All you got to do is press play. You can pause it too. And you can also click this button to go to the next clip, and so on. Back a clip. And yeah, that's about it when it comes to this stuff. Um, say you uh, want to check them all again, you don't want to do this, just say check all. Uncheck all, check all, uncheck all. Just use that button. And I'm going to find these clips again. There they are. I'm going to check them. Like I said, they're short little clips. And I'm going to be using them in the next tutorial I'll make as well. So, And for this tutorial, it won't take long to import them, so it's perfect. I'm going to import them. And what is this? It says create new event. What is an event? Well, an event is, if you look over here, these are all events. They all have titles. And basically what it, an event is, is, uh, well, let me give you an example. An event's like a folder. Say you had a group of pictures. Uh, you know, funny pictures. Uh, pictures for Facebook, pictures of family. It's it's the same thing, you know, you want to sort your videos just like you would sort your pictures. 
and that's what an event is. It's just a folder that categorizes and allows you to sort and be more organized with your videos. You probably got what an event was right away, I just thought I'd explain it a little more in depth. So I already have an event made, iMovie Tutorials, so I'm just going to say add to existing event. But since you're new to this, just uh, create a new event and title it whatever you think suits best. So like I said, I got a lot of events here, but I'm just going to put it to iMovie Tutorials to keep uh, my clips nice and organized. So I'm going to say import. And as they import, a little white line below the thumbnail happens. You know, you can just wait a little bit. Since these are short clips, it doesn't take very long. And a little thing pops up, import 11 seconds from three clips and three clips and eleven seconds. Okay, so just close out of this window and way to go. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Hopefully I didn't talk too slow. Um, just leave a comment below if you want me to speed it up and make them like a minute long or leave a comment saying if you like it being this long and really well in depth. Uh, thank you, and be sure to check out my next video where I edit these clips and show you how to cut them. Alright, that's all.